is done and we are ready to race. Okay, so you probably get the gist of it, but after the race weekend, after everything that was going on, I just couldn't face doing it again. Absolutely burnt, burnt out, spent, couldn't do it, couldn't face it, wasn't fair on family. So I got on the phone to the only people I ever would, dragged the car up here late one night, dragged the gearbox over to Martin at Gas and Gears, and here we are. She's done, she's finished. Martin's rebuilt the box, everything is sorted. We've identified what went wrong and why. I think I might cover that in another video or later on tonight. The box is rebuilt, looks incredible. The guys have got it all back in. They've even put all the aero and everything back on for me that I really did not expect. And here we are. We're just about to load up one week until we leave for Brands Hatch. I cannot thank these guys enough for fitting it in. Thanks to Mark for rebuilding the box again. Thanks to Badger 5, absolute legends. They've worked a lot of hours on this because nothing is ever simple. And we actually caused a few issues by throwing it together in a hurry in the paddock, which Alex and the boys have overcome. Yeah, big, big thanks. We're going racing again. Let's get it loaded up, let's get home. So there we go, locked, loaded, ready for Brands Hatch. I'm gonna take it home, clean it out, and otherwise we're all good to go. Massive, massive, massive thanks to Bill and the boys for sorting this. Another big thanks to Mark for doing the gearbox. But we're done, it's amazing how everyone comes together. The help and the support we've had is phenomenal. You guys as well. I've put a couple of posts on Facebook over the last few weeks asking for parts and a bit of help, and the response has been phenomenal. I'm rambling now. I'm going to wrap this one up. Short video this week. I love you all very much. Tune in next week. Find out where we are. It might even be time for a brands video. See you later, guys. Take care.